Hello, hockey fans out there. It's me, Sportsman Z, Bob Zolke. And today I am here with another action PC hockey game. Today it's going to be the 1996 Avalanche visiting the 1996 Hartford Whalers. Uh, the uh, coach of the uh, the uh, Colorado Avalanche in 1996 was Mark Crawford, and the coach of the Hartford Whalers was Paul Maurice. Today we will be taking Hartford against the much-favored um, Colorado Avalanche. And if, as you can see on the screen, the starting lineups for the teams. For Colorado, you've got Valerie Kamensky at left wing, Peter Forsberg at center, Adam Deadmarsh is at right wing, Sandis Ozelinch is at left defense. Alexei Guzarov is at right defense. And you've got Patrick Waugh in the net. For the Hartford Whalers, the starting lineup will be Jeff Sanderson at left wing. Andrew Cassells at center. Kevin Deneen at right wing. Kevin Haller at left defense. Glenn Wesley will be the right defenseman, and Sean Burke is in the net today. Sean Burke has a had a 9.14 save percentage and 2.63 goals against uh, average, while Patrick Waugh had a 9.23 save percentage and 2.31 goals against average. How nice it would have been to be back in the day where the goalies actually had high save percentages and low goals against averages, as opposed to today. So, uh, with that, let's get started here. Uh, I'm going to start with a balanced offense, or the balanced uh, team out there. And, uh, yeah, we're going to allow them to be over the limit, uh, everybody to be over the limit, just an exhibition game. And we'll click any key to continue. Click any key to continue. Uh, we're going to go aggressive. And again, I'm going to go aggressive until there's a score. And if the score is for us, I'm going to stay aggressive. If the score is for them, we'll see what we do. Um, I'm going to go in my own end. You know what? In my own end, let's, let's play it safe. And, ooh, ooh, what is that? A fight? Fight going on? Oh, both going to the penalty box. Both in the sin bin. Claude Lemieux. Very surprising that Claude Lemieux would get involved in a fracas. And you've got Keith Primu, who was the guy that was involved with us. So, um, we will go from there. All right, so I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go normal. We will uh, pass and cycle. We're gonna take the inside shot with King. I think is what they said, and it's gonna be a deflection, and they're back down in our end. That was quick. And there's going to be a save by Burke and a face-off to Burke's left. We're going to go safe down here in our own end again. Score is 0 0 of the first period. And there is a deflection out front. And um, we have the puck back. Now I'm going to go aggressive, try to get it back, work it back into the Colorado end. And um, we're going to pass and cycle. And uh, let's take a shot. Let's do it. Let's take a shot from there. And it's going to be a save by Wa and a face off to Wa's right. I'm going to go normal. And eh. Nelson Emerson. I'm going to shoot. Let's shoot. And it's a save again. But we're getting we're getting shots at least. So. 
there is a save in our end. Uh, I'm going to go aggressive. Let's try to get it out of our end. And it does work. I'm going to pass and cycle. Pass and cycle. Um, let's skate and pass. And, ooh, a shot that just missed the net. Pass and cycle. Pass and cycle. Let's see. I mean, we've got, we're controlling the puck down in their end, and now it's down in the other end. Now it's down in our end. And there's a shot that just misses the net. We're going to, I'm going to let the CPU decide here. Then we're going to go aggressive. Zero all here. And there's a penalty. We've got a penalty on Glenn Featherstone. He's going to the box. So we're shorthanded. Got to go safe here. And it's a giveaway. 12.23 of the first period. And that's going to be a save by Burke. And we're going to clear the puck. Try to clear the puck. I don't know if that worked real well. <laughs> Apparently it did. Uh, they're, let's see, they're going to shoot and they missed the net. Looks like that was Claude Lemieux who missed the net. We're going to continue. And uh, we're going to clear. Let's clear it because we've still got the penalty. Featherstone still has 23 seconds left in the penalty. Let's clear it. Didn't clear. Couldn't do it. Let's. They take a shot and they miss the net. And the penalty is over. So we're at the 10.33 mark of the first period. Still tied at 0-0. Zero, zero. Saved by Burke and a face-off to Burke's left. Uh, let's go aggressive. I'm going to go aggressive. And it doesn't work. They end up with the puck. Colorado does. And they uh, shoot. And it's a save by Burke with a rebound. Let's go aggressive. There's a hit. Continue. And uh, let's see. Ooh, we're going to the penalty box again. This time it's Andrew Cassells is going to the penalty box. So we're going to have to play safe. Play it safe here. 0-0. Zero, zero. We got a two-minute penalty we got to kill off. There's a save by Burke. 8.45 of the first period. There's another shot and a save by Burke, and we're going to clear it. Try to clear it. And it is unsuccessful, apparently. There's a shot and a save by Burke and a rebound. We're going to try to clear the puck. And Claude Lemieux is back in the end, back in our end, and he shoots, and it's a save by Burke. Burke is, uh, he's playing a really great game here. Another save by him, it looked like. 7.20 left, and uh, Cassell's still, uh, he had a more than a two-minute penalty, so he's still in the box for 2.15. And that's a score! It's a, it's a power play goal by the Colorado Avalanche, Valerie Kamensky with the score and assists by Claude Lemieux and Joe Sackick, their main men. So anyway, we're going to the face-off and uh, giveaway, giveaway, and they're back down in our end again. So they're already up one nothing. 6.46 of the first period. Another uh, shot, but it's stopped by the defenseman. That's a save by Burke. We're going to continue. We're down one nothing here. And there is a, uh, a block out front. Um, and there's a fatigue alert. So I'm going to go CPU here. I'll let the CPU just clear that up. We're going to go continue. And, uh, yeah, we, uh, 
there is a shot and a miss. And a save by Burke, another shot and a save by Burke. I'm going to be interested to see what the, what the uh, first period statistics are. We'll go balanced. Looks like it went out of uh, out of play. There's a hit. Continue. They shoot and they miss the net. The shot misses. We have control of the puck. Let's go aggressive. We shoot and there was a lot of traffic out front. That one didn't have a chance. Giveaway. And we've got the puck. I'm going to go aggressive. I'm, I'm still going to go aggressive even though we're down one nothing. That's not too bad. Fatigue alert for Kevin Deneen. I'll let the CPU clear that up. Uh, shot and a miss. We missed the net on that. We're going to continue. And there's going to be a save by Burke again. So yeah, he's, a, he's been a pin cushion today. We're going to still go aggressive. Let's go uh, skater pass. Um, I'm going to say pass. And I guess that did not work. Pass and cycle. And that is the end of the first period. And so here are the statistics. 18 shots for Colorado. So we're right. Uh, Burke has been a pincushion. We only had three shots. Scoring chances, they out score chanced us 7-2. to two. <laughs> Blocked shots, we had five block shots. They had two. So... Um, yeah, they were, I mean, this Colorado offense has been relentless. We're lucky, probably, that, we, uh, that we've that we even been, that we're only down one nothing at the end of the first period because I got to tell you, um, we, uh, yeah, we, uh, we've got to get our offense going. I mean, three shots for an entire period is not going to cut it and uh, um, yeah so so we'll have to uh, there's the uh, we'll have to we have to get our offense um, We gotta get my offense going. So we're gonna stay aggressive, and uh, they win the face off, and they bring it down into our end. They shoot, and there's another save by uh, by Burke. Gonna go aggressive. Um, we're down in the now. We're down in the Colorado end. And there's a shot, and it misses the net. Let's go aggressive. There's a giveaway. We've it looks like we've got the puck, but no, they I guess they did and they shot and uh, now we have the puck. We're gonna go aggressive. We're gonna stay aggressive. Try to get this going. There is a shot and it looks like that was a shot on net and a save by Wa. We're gonna go normal and the puck goes into the corner gonna go aggressive there's another fight are you kidding me another fight and yeah they're both going to the box let's see who this is Joe Sackick in a fight with Glenn Wesley who would think that so anyway I didn't know Sackick was known as a fighter but uh, there is a shot that misses the net by us and is that gonna be a penalty Adam Deadmarsh yeah, Adam Deadmarsh is in the box, so we got a power play. And we're going to have our power play offense out there. Go to pass and cycle. Pass and cycle. And we're going to shoot. Shoot it! And, ooh, that wasn't even close, and it was deflected by one of the, uh, one of the uh, Avalanche players. I'm going to shoot 47% chance from there. I like those odds. And no, it's a save by Wah. 
I shouldn't have liked those odds. We're going to go power play. Um, and it's deflected out front by one of the Avalanche players. Pass and cycle. I like this. We're doing a little bit of a better attack, although that's because we're um, on a power play. That should be the case. We're going to let the CPU clear up the uh, fatigue. There is a shot and a save by Wa, And we're going to let the uh, CPU again clear it up. And uh, what's going on here? We're going to dump and chase. Let's dump and chase. I haven't done that yet. They shoot, and it's a save by our main man, Burke. He is the Burke is the only reason we're still in this game. We're gonna go aggressive because we can't get anything going against the Colorado defense. We're gonna go aggressive and click the shoot, and he tried to get close, but they took we took the puck away. I'm going to go aggressive again. And, oh, another fight. Fights are breaking out left and right here. And go into the box. Let's see who this is. Aaron Miller and Kevin Haller. So we're going to go normal. Rush. Hit. Going to skater pass. There's a giveaway. We gave the. It looks like we gave the puck away, and they're down in our end. But now we're back in. Er, all right, they've got another uh, penalty. Eric Messier with the penalty, and we are on another power play. You know, one of these you would think we could score. There's a shot, but Wa makes the save. We're gonna go power play again. Another shot, and that is a save by Wa. Gonna go power play, pass and cycle, pass and cycle, pass and cycle. Fatigue alert, we'll let the uh, CPU clear that up. 10.03 left in the second period. Halfway through the second period and still losing 1 0. Fatigue alert, we'll let the CPU clear it up. Let the CPU clear it up. <laughs> Um, so let's see, I really don't, I still don't know all that much about how to play the game, but, um, I think I'm, you know, I'm getting by, I suppose. Uh, I mean, we're only losing one nothing, even though we're being massively outplayed. And we may be being massively outplayed because we're just not as good as Colorado in 1996. So, um, we're going to go, let's play it safe down here. There's a shot, and it's a save deflected by uh, by Burke. We're going to go balanced. Shooting the puck, but there was too much traffic out front, so we're going to continue. They're going to shoot, and it's a save by Burke again. We're down in the other end. Pass and cycle. 7.19 left in the second period. Going to continue. Uh, there's a lot of traffic out in front of Burke, and they're about to shoot, but they it gets knocked down. There's a hit. We're going to continue. Another hit. We're in their end. Continue. Uh, they work it back to our side. We're going to go aggressive. Hit. And they're bringing it in, and they shoot. Oh, man, that was all alone, and Burke made the save. So there's going to be a face-off to Burke's right. Um, let's play it safe down here in our own end. Shot that misses the net. We're down on the other end, and we missed the, sh we missed the net on the shot. There's a hit, which technically makes it not a shot. On goal, at least. Continue. Still only losing one nothing. Four oh three, three forty two in the second period. Pass and cycle. Pass and cycle. There's a hit. Continue. Aggressive. 
shoot and we miss the net on the shot continue uh, let's see continue and that's going to be a shot that is saved by Wa. you can see Wa is rated an 8.6 and uh, Burke is rated a 7.7 .7. So we're still only losing one nothing as the second period is coming quickly to a close. Um, I'm going to go definitely, let's see, draw forward. And that's a shot that Wah saves. They shoot, and there's a save by Burke. And that is a great save. Apparently that was a great save by Burke. I mean, it really, he's getting overworked as it is. We're going to go aggressive. And 30 seconds left in the period. 16 seconds left. Going to go aggressive. Dump and chase. And that's that. So here are the second period stats. Uh, now this period we did a lot better. We were only outshot 7-5. to five. The defense was a little better, and so was really the offense. Scoring chances, they had four. We only had one, really. Block shots, they had five. We had three. And power plays, we were 0-2 on the power play. So we're still losing one nothing. We'll go to the third period, losing one nothing. Going to do aggressive. I mean, that's the only. I think that's the only way we're going to get back into this game. We got to play, keep an aggressive, um, uh, an aggressive. I don't know what the word would be, but uh, there. Let's see. Shoot. Ah, that was way off. The shot was uh, was way off on that. Another shot, and we missed the net. So we. I mean, we're missing the net a lot here. There's a hit. I'm going to continue. Draw back. Shoot, 51%. Let's try that. No, not even close. There's another fight. Not another fight. <laughs> At the 1652 mark of the third period, you've got Keith Jones. Keith Jones and Paul Coffey, Coast to Coast Coffey. All right, so we're going to go aggressive. And there is a save out front. And I call him Coast to Coast Coffee because when I used to play NHL 94, I think it was, every time Coffee got the puck, I would, I, would just, he, I would just have him take it all the way down the ice and try to score. So uh, my roommate at the time was like, coast to coast coffee. So there's a hit. Uh, we're going to press any key to shoot, and they score again, and we're losing 2 nothing now. We are in real trouble. And uh, that's Uwe Krupp, the Uwe Krupp on the goal. So we're going to go, um, uh, I mean, now we really got to go aggressive because that's the only way we're going to get back into this. We're not, I mean, we've been going aggressive most of the time all throughout this game, and we don't even have a goal yet to show for it. So there's a shot, but it's deflected out front by one of the uh, Whalers players. We're going to go aggressive. There's a hit. Um, we're going to continue. Going to go aggressive. Pass and cycle. Pass and cycle. There's a hit. Um, I'm going aggressive. There's a shot and it misses the net again. We have missed the net so many times on shots this game. It's crazy. We're going to shoot 46%. i got to take what I can get. And it's saved by Wah. And he makes a great save. But it is Patrick Waugh, who is now the coach of the Islanders. I'm not so happy to say, but <laughs> we're going to draw forward. And there's a shot that misses the net. It's a little wide. At least that's not as bad as some of the shots that have missed. We're going to go aggressive. 
we're gonna go aggressive and there there's the uh, we lost the puck I think yeah and uh, let's see I'm gonna continue giveaway I'm gonna go aggressive There's a shot out front, but it was uh, deflected by one of the uh, Colorado players. 8.53 left in the game. I'm going to say we're really not going to win this one. We're down 2 nothing. This was a pretty good game. I mean, we were outplayed. We were seriously outplayed. But considering that we were outplayed, this was a good game. And there is a deflection by Burke. And there's a shot by us, but Wah makes the save, of course. We're going to draw forward. And there is a, uh, we lose the puck. We're going to pass and cycle. Pass and cycle, there's a hit. Going to continue. There's a hit. Going to continue. 627 left in the game. There's a shot that goes wide again, story of our life in this game. We're going to skate or pass. We shoot, but it's deflected out front by one of the, uh, in fact, uh, maybe it was Lemieux, but anyway, we're going to go aggressive. And that's a shot that was uh, another great save by Wah. I mean, you're, if you're going to go up against a guy like Wah, you got to take the... Um, you got to take the uh, stand that he's going to make some great saves. Jeff Sanderson. I'm going to shoot. And that is deflected out front by one of the Avalanche players. 401 left. They shoot, and it's another score, and they're up 3 nothing. And now I can safely say we are not going to win this game. Valerie Kamensky. With the goal, is that his second goal this game? Adam Deadmarsh on the assist and Forsberg. I think that was like the same exact, uh, <laughs> that was the same exact uh, goal uh, assists and goal, I think, on, as on the first one. But anyway, we're going to go aggressive. I mean, you know, what the heck now? It's, eh, you know, the horse has left the barn. We're not going to win this one. Uh, 320 left. We're down 3 nothing. Lashizen. I can't even pronounce I know how it's pronounced. I just can't pronounce it. So we're going to pass and cycle. Coffee is going to... I'm going to try to penetrate with coffee. And we're going to shoot and miss the net. So we're going to dump and chase. I mean, even a goal there wouldn't have really helped us. It would have been 3-1. to one. Um, We're going to draw forward. And the puck is taken away. They shoot and they miss the net. We're going to continue. Minute 15 left. And that's another goal. Are you kidding? What? Wait a minute. No, it wasn't. All right. I thought it went in. But anyway, it's a, it was a save by Burke. We're going to go uh, aggressive. <laughs> Trying to... Oh! Little tussle and they missed the net. They're shooting again, though, and it's a save by Burke. Aggressive. And um, that's it. That's it for in the third period shots were four apiece. The scoring chances were four for the uh, Avalanche, zero for us. Block shots were five for the Avalanche, two for us. And game is over. And uh, so let's see. I don't know, we can probably f let's see. Uh, Complete. Um, okay, so here we go. This is the uh, this is for the entire game. Shots on goal. We were outshot twenty nine to twelve. Um, hits twenty two to twelve for Colorado. Blocks twelve to ten for Colorado. 
missed net. Now, that's 13 for us, which I believe. Eight for them. Uh, shot attempts, 47 for them, 37 for us. Scoring chances, 15 for them, only three for us. We went this entire game, we only averaged one scoring chance per period. Penalties in minutes, 12 for them, 14 for us. Power plays, they were 1 for 4, Colorado was, and we were 0 for 2. Um, so that is, that's the story of the game here. As we lose this game to the Colorado Avalanche 1996 matchup, and we lose the game 3 nothing. It was good going into the third. We were only down one nothing going into the third, but the Colorado Avalanche got three or got two in the last period and end up winning the game three nothing. And that's going to be it for me, Bob Zolke, Sportsman Z from Hartford, Connecticut.